Hey, what's up guys? Andrew here. Today I'm going to show you how to reset the HP Stream 11 laptop back to factory settings. This method is very useful if you're trying to sell the laptop, forgot your password, or you're experiencing computer issues, slowdowns, virus, malware, etc. Keep in mind this will wipe the laptop back to factory settings just like new when you bought it. Alright guys, there are three methods to try. The first one is holding down the power button for 15 seconds. Make sure you, when you're starting this method, make sure the computer is turned off. So if this computer was off right now, you would hold this down for 15 seconds. And then it would get into the access to recovery menu. Now if that doesn't work, here goes the second option. You hold down delete and power at the same time. So keep this in mind when you're starting, when you're starting fresh, make sure the computer is off, holding on delete and power button. And last but not least, the third method, which worked for me, was holding down delete and F11 at the same time. Remember, the computer has to be turned off when you're doing this method. So again, delete and F11 at the same time, holding it down, and then the computer will boot, and it'll say, please wait, and then release those keys. And then you'll have access to the recovery menu, where you can reset the laptop back to factory settings. Now, if you want to fully secure the laptop and fully wipe it if you're trying to sell it, so select the method that appears that uh, it will take longer to reset. That way, it'll securely erase the hard drive to prevent people from recovering it. Alright guys, be sure to put down in the comments down below which method worked for you. Method 1, where you're holding down the power button. Or method 2, holding down delete and power. Or method 3, holding down delete and F11. Alright, I'm very curious which method worked. Put down which laptop you had and which method. This will really help out the HP community. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.